At first glance, it looks like an ordinary wheelchair, but it's only when you look closer that you realise how different this chair is. No wheels, just walking legs. It's the invention of 21-year-old Martin Harris. It's taken him a year to develop the chair. The walking mechanism it uses is inspired by the work of artist and engineer Theo Janssen. Um, he built walking sculptures to walk across beaches, walk across sand, and all sorts of rough terrain. And the mechanism used to do that has been developed by him over quite a few years. And I've chosen to use it in a wheelchair to provide a practical purpose for it. The legs underneath are made of 216 separate pieces bolted together. Like an ordinary electric wheelchair, it can go at up to four miles an hour, and even steers like one. The walking mechanism is based on 12 legs working in pairs underneath the chair. It's all linked together. It's all a mechanical linkage, so there's only two motors driving it. It's all powered by conventional wheelchair controllers, batteries and motors. The chair has the advantage that it can travel on any surface, dirt or even grass. It can walk up moderate slopes. Martin sees it as advantageous to wheelchair users who are currently restricted to paths. A leg can simply just pick itself up and step over an obstacle. Back inside Derby University's Mark Eaton site, where he's designed it, Martin turns heads. It also shows the chair can work well inside on polished floors or carpets. It'll need more development to overcome all the disadvantages of a normal wheelchair. It does overcome um, like a few of the major ones, such as walking on sand and walking off-road. But walking indoors, there's still a lot to be said for the wheel. Despite Martin's modesty, he still sees the chair as having other applications in the future, possibly agricultural or even military. James Roberson, East Midlands Today, 